Hey there YouTube, France Hopper here. It's Thursday the 30th of January and we're gonna open a mysterious brown box today. Actually it's not mysterious at all. This is some music that I ordered from CD Japan about a month ago. Got this shipped via SAL so that does take usually about two to four weeks to come in. It's basically the El Cheapo shipping from Japan. Um, but usually I just kind of open these boxes up and just get listening to the music that comes in. But this is the first time I ordered a vinyl from them, and I thought maybe you might like to see kind of what it looks like, you know, getting a typical package from CD Japan in general. So let's go ahead and let's open this up and take a look at what we have in here. We have our lovely little packing slip to begin with. So here is what we're going to be unboxing today. Two CDs and a vinyl. And if you're interested in picking up any of those items, I'll put a link in the description so that you can. But one of the things that I like about CD Japan a lot, um, you may also know them as Neo Wing, as that's what they trade under in actual Japan, um, is that the folks there, they, they really care. It, you know, every single one of these definitely gives the impression of being hand-packed by someone who actually cared about what they were doing and didn't just simply throw things in there. And I appreciate that a lot, especially when some of these items sometimes can be kind of fragile. Um, they sell a lot more than just music. Um, they do some household goods, um, collectible character goods, all sorts of various different things. And um, if you get the EMS shipping, that's pretty fast. It's usually like one to three days. Um, it's the most expensive because it is so fast. So I usually just go with SAL. You save a couple of bucks and it gets there, you know, in about, about a month. And you can still track it online for the most part. Um, they also have a really great points program, which a lot of times I'll use my points to just basically write off shipping. But uh, here's what we have. We have Volume 1 of the soundtrack from The Rising of the Shield Hero. This is Dawn. I already had the... Um, actually, no, this is Volume 2. I take it back. I had Volume 1 previously, so now we got the complete set. We have the 2019 Miku Symphony, which came with a clear file, because I think I got the first run of it. Don't have a Blu-ray, because apparently this time they didn't do one, which is a little disappointing, because it's always cool to watch those. Um, funny enough, the day after I bought that, it came out on Apple Music, so I've been listening to it already. Um, but this is probably the highlight of this box, I would say. Um, this is Mitchy M's latest uh, album um, for Vocaloid. And saw it on vinyl and was like, you know what, Let, let's do something different with uh, some vinyl and uh, get some Vocaloid on vinyl, because why the heck not? And this is, looks like a pretty simple slip case. We got two LPs in here. Let's take one out and just quickly take a look at it here. Oh, that's very nice and thick. So... Nice, pretty typical black LP, you know, with some color on it. And there is, I think, some liner notes in here. Yeah, there we go. And, of course, your typical liner notes that you'd find on any good vinyl, really. Which is mostly just the track listing. Although it looks like we also have uh, the lyrics on here. Very cool. So anyway, quick little unboxing. Just kind of wanted to show you what it will usually looks like when you get something from CD Japan. They're very fine folks. And uh, if you're interested in any of those goodies we just took a look at, uh, link to them is in the description. But that is it. Thanks for watching.